Well, good evening, travelers, and look where we are. We are at Disney's Wilderness Lodge, and it's about 8.30 at night. We are going to Whispering Canyon for dinner. One of our favorite places, it's a, it's a family-style dinner that they serve in skillets. So we're going to head over to Whispering Canyon. So come along, let's head on over there. rock work right here but sometimes there's hidden Mickeys everywhere you just gotta look really hard for them but... sadly Artist Point and Territory Lounge have not reopened at the Wilderness Lodge here but Territory Lounge is right there that you see behind the window is one of our favorite places to come they got some great artwork it's a really nice lounge to come to and then there's also some not hidden Mickeys around. I love this totem pole right outside the mercantile. Okay guys, so when you come to the Wilderness Lodge, you will see this large totem pole here over by the concierge check-in. And then on that side, there's another large totem pole over by the Whispering Canyon. Due to Native American heritage and folklore, they're actually off-centered a little bit, so they do not face each other because they feel it is bad luck for them to line up and face each other. So that's why these two totem poles are a little off-center of each other. I love the TP light fixtures in here. I, oh, this is such a gorgeous resort. If you've never been here, you definitely gotta come. Okay, we just got our buzz that our table is ready. I see the family over there waiting because I was in the gift shop looking at a new Donald watch that I really want, so heading that way now. There we go. I love the seating areas here with the high back chairs. And there's the interior of Whispering Canyon right there. Oh, this one of my, oh, I just love the mashed potatoes here. Whispering Canyon, we just sat down so we can take our face. No, we cannot take our facial coverings off yet because we have no drinks or food yet. So we're overlooking the menus, which are via the curry codes. They have it in English and then on the back. Let's see, Espanol, Francis, and Portuguese right there. So um, this is how you scan it when you come to Whispering Canyon. So as soon really as our server comes and gets us some drinks, we'll probably like remove our facial covering. Yes. The only Which hard menu they give you is the drink menu. <laughs> so they're going to let you know what you can drink. So they do give you that, but everything else is on the curry code. Uh, this mask, I can't wait to take it off. Okay, this is the only restaurant. Well, no, there's other restaurants, but I get sweet tea here. I absolutely love sweet tea here. So what Whispering Canyon is really known for is the family style skillets, but it's actually individual skillets. My son over there, <laughs> banging on the table. Um, it's, I'm gonna want to go I know, to they're not ever want to come to dinner with us again. God, this mess is killing me. Come on, Martin, bring my drink. They should say well, actually, you're drinking water so Martin it's brought my tea so. right here. <laughs> That's a great tea. So Ow, see, you're so excited. You need to calm down. You're going to chip your tooth. I'm not going to chip my tooth. Oh, their sweet tea is so good here. I know I'm usually a water drinker, but... Here, sweet tea. So they, Martin just brought the cornbread. It's a nice sweet cornbread. It's got a regular butter spread. So we're gonna give this a try. I know I already like it, but we're gonna give it a try for you guys. And I can't see. It's still as good as usual. It looks so good. Yeah, And it's not some. It's nice and moist. It's not as crumbly as some cornbreads. But this is very good cornbread. I cannot wait for the skillets to come. Okay. 
Nice. Look at that piece. Michelle got her great. If okay. you see this on the video, I'd be like, well, I want the pig. Our food just came. Tell Our food just bigger. came. Yeah. And you'll I notice see. that there's one platter is bigger than the other. One's a piggy platter and one's a traditional platter. So, but our food just came, but so no, we No, that's can't. not why. Well, yes, it is. No, that's a traditional. Because we got, because four, we that got the four oh, yeah. people. Four people got the piggy, one got the traditional, no. so that's why the that's difference in the sizes is no, when you see those I on ordered. film. Did they bring the barbecue sauce? No. No, we don't have the barbecue sauce either. Now we're gonna try the pork belly. Nice and fatty. I shouldn't be eating this early tonight. <laughs> what? And it's not that late. It is late. It, that's, that's almost my bedtime. Getting close anyway. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> 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 now, um, what's the, the sausage is really good too. I love this whole meal. This is really a good. You just keep eating till you get the meat sweats. And these are the mashed potatoes I came for. <laughs> right here. I'm going to spend $34 on so mashed potatoes. They're so good tonight. Mm. Mm. Those are so good. I, what did we have mashed potatoes just recently? I have to go back and look at one of our videos. Where did we have them? Oh, uh, Olivia's. Those are good mashed potatoes. But these are good mashed potatoes too. Yeah, I'll link that video oh, yeah. down below of the Olivia's lunch with those mashed away? potatoes. I'm not ready yet, so go ahead. Okay, on the piggy wings, they're, they're okay, but they are a little dry. They need a little more sauce on them. Um, I would say the lemon veggies. herb chicken, which I'm getting ready to have now, this is a very good chicken. I mean, we, we Let's give this a try. Oh, really? All right. Yeah. Mm. A little hard for you. Nice and moist. See what in there? This is good chicken. Chicken and the mashed potatoes are great. Okay, so the consensus of the table is the piggy wings are a little dry and not really our favorites. But the barbecued ribs, the one I'm getting ready to have here, are nice and saucy. So let's give this a try. Oh yeah. Mm. Nice and moist, pull right off the bone. What's the sauce like? It's very tart, but it's still good. It's a little but vinegary. I think it's a vinegary based. But this is a really good rib. Mm. And vinegar, is that not a word? Vinegar? Oh, yeah, vinegar. That's a word. It's now. Oh, you like the rib? Okay. Michelle does not like the rib, so I'm going to finish this one for her. You don't like the rib? I don't think you like the barbecue sauce. It seems like. Yeah, she doesn't like the barbecue sauce, that's why. That would so I'll finish this one. I love the barbecue sauce here. Yeah, it's, really good. yeah, it's not one of those sweet hickory type barbecue sauces. It doesn't have any sweet hickory. I just don't want it to be vinegary on my. It's just been. It's a vinegar based. It's a vinegar based barbecue sauce. Mm -hmm. I I liked it. I think it's pretty good. I'm glad. She didn't like my sandwich either. Remember that video? I'll link that down below. Hey. So my daughter oh, wanted her own mashed potatoes. So they like brought sausage? her own little dish of mashed potatoes. I would rather, yeah, but you I should the eat these. Eat but I'll give them to her. Uh -huh. We do like the sausage. The sausage is really good. Well, you don't eat the portion. This is stressful. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this is a stressful eating because we got to remember what we like to eat. Honestly, it's we're rationing. Sausage. Right? Honestly. Yeah, we're rationing. Okay, everybody's starting to fade at the table. I have Not determined the <laughs> sausage. The ribs, 
<laughs> as you can tell. And the mashed potatoes are my favorite thing on all three of these. The pork belly's good. It is a little fatty, but that's my favorite three items. The chicken, too. I did have the chicken. So four things. The four favorite things on there. I'd like to show you what we didn't like. Okay. It's on the table. Yeah, we, we would like to show you what we didn't like the piggy wings. Like and you didn't like them. And did not like them. my future son-in-law did not yeah. like the green beans. Black. I enjoyed the green beans. They are a little crunchy. They're raw. They They're crunchy them. people. They're not raw. Okay. They're good. But the piggy wings, nobody at the table liked the piggy wings tonight. Nope. Apparently, all of us James Beard award winning chefs <laughs> think if you took the green beans and sauteed them in this the pork is not belly. A southern green bean. If no. you, if you sauteed these in the pork crazy. belly, this would be really good. I, I, I enjoy the green beans. It's the rest of my crew here that don't care for them. That's the point. Where are we at? Whispering Canyon. God almighty, I've eaten so much food, I don't know where I am at. Thank if you. you happen to come to Whispering Canyons, ask for Martin's section. He's actually a server that came over from Artist Point since it's not open, and he's now here. He has been fantastic and on point tonight. Mm -hmm. Martin's pretty awesome. <laughs> These two kids with me, they tickle themselves. They make their own jokes. <laughs> like I said, all the skillets were $34, but also drinks are not included in the skillet price, so it's four twenty nine. For the beverages also. So really it's thirty eight I don't know what they twenty nine for the meal. Because they're so tickled. For Cokes, sweet tea, nothing for the water. We did use our tables in Wonderland, so we got twenty percent off of that. So then I still think this is a very good meal. We enjoyed it. Finishing up my tea. So much to drink of it. I will have to say which I've never seen before. Um, Martin brought us boxes for all the leftover stuff that we had in our skillets, which is great because there's no waste. We're finishing up our dinner. It was a great dinner tonight. The company is always great. Live, love, laugh. Live, love, laugh, as my daughter likes to say. Plus, they were talking about their honeymoon that they're getting ready to book to Hawaii. Alani. And I don't get to go to Alani with them. I'm so sad. The monkey pie. <laughs> All their, my daughter's just planning on places to eat in Hawaii. Pizza but everything was fantastic. And I, like I said, the only thing we didn't like were the piggy wings. But other than that, was great. If you guys like following along in our travels, don't forget to hit the like button, the subscribe button, and hit the notification bell. We do these quite often so you guys know when, what's coming up and when our next video drops. And remember, travelers, as always, like we like to say, traveling around Disney, travel and adventure is out there. I need my screenshot. That's all you care to eat. I feel sorry for. I feel sorry for Martin. And as one of the great YouTubers out there would say, best remove them. Ah.